name is Francis and I'll be showing you guys how to install Python on Windows or how to set it up on Windows. Um, firstly, we have to open up our browser and obviously search for our Python. And go to download. We could use this, but I'll prefer to go down. Yes, and search. Okay, we are looking for this. Um. Uh -huh. Now I will show you how to know if your system is 64 bit or 32 bit. You open up your file manager, right? Click on this PC properties. We have see this is a 64 bit operating system and a 64 bit processor, which already tells us what we are supposed to go for. And I'm going to close that. We'll go for the 64 bit installer, but I do already have the installer, so I'll skip that. And for macOS users, you can get this or you can use Brew to install it. Now, to install that. You can see this is not ticked. If I were to install it like this, I won't be able to use Python in the in my command prompt. Let's say I want to run a file, I will not be able to type Python. Instead, what will work is is py. Just py will work. And I'll show you an example of what I mean. So I'll go ahead and install that. Um, it's going to probably take a while, so I'm going to be right. Okay guys, we are back and you can see it's done installing, so I will close that and um, look for, open my command prop cmd and I will type um, python dash dash version, we can see it says python not found because of I did not add python to the part, but if I was to type py dash dash version we have an output Python 3.10 which is what we installed so to remedy this particular issue we'll go back to our installer modify we could leave everything as it is next and this is what we need add Python to environment variable so install that Okay, we are done. Now, if I was to still try that command here, it won't still work because it's not been updated. So I would launch another command prompt. And do that again. You can see no error like it is here. No error. The same with the py. No error. Now, I would do like to mention something. If you didn't add Python to your environment, it's more than likely that it will not install pip for you. Like pip will be installed, but it will not be able. To, it won't work the same way as this Python did not work here. So you will only be able to use pip if you upgrade it. If you add Python to your um, parts. Or use py -m pip install or whatever pip command you want to use pip install dot 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 anything so that's just a quick show now I also show you guys how to install Python from the store in case you have the store that's Windows store you just need to open it up I think it's available from um, Windows 10 upwards or will I say it started from 8 so we search for Python. As you can see, we have um, 3.10, 3.7. There are others, there are others. We just click on it. And 
and once we install it we will not need to download python from the website we will not need to install it ourselves it just works once you install it it will just work i won't do that since i already have python but it will just work and you might be wondering why probably because of they are in different directories or so so i think that's all so that's all for python on windows see you guys later